I remember back in the day, I was bored looking for something else to play on the computer. I stumbled upon RuneScape, so I downloaded, logged in, and was instantly disappointed. The game was crap compared to the other things I was playing, but I was intrigued by it. Something about it called out for me to play it. And over the years, I ignored it. I had life. I've grown up. And just a little bit ago, I started uh, playing it again with a, a newer version of the client. And just a couple days ago, there's a new new client called NXT that fixes all of the problems that I've ever had with this game. This isn't it right now. This is old school RuneScape. So let's take a look at NXT. Well, here it is, the NXT client for RuneScape. Right now we're taking a look at things in reverse here. I got all the graphical settings off. And I'm going to turn them on here. And really the first thing you notice, even when I had everything down except for the draw distance, was the draw distance, how far you could see in this with this client. It's really impressive, really. So let's uh, start walking around here. And now I'm pretty sure, sure you'll notice that there isn't uh, any stuttering or loading of uh, new map zones. It's all pretty seamless, smooth, and high frame rate. Which some might argue that it's not really necessary for a high frame rate in this game, but I'm a big arguer for the fact that every game should have the ability to have high frame rate. If you're running a desktop, you don't want to be limited at all. There, sh there shouldn't be any more power draw with higher frame rates if the game isn't demanding. And this game isn't demanding, so my, three my clocks on my 3D card don't go up, don't consume power. That's how things work. Even on processors. But anyway, I'm getting off on a tangent here. This is going to make me play the game every night even more so than the previous client. So, let's get out of here, watch this little cutscene in reverse, and do a little side-by-side uh, -side comparison between the previous client and this client. So, here we got the NXT client next to the previous client, pretty much doing the same uh, little path here. I uh, recorded this just one after another on the same day. Uh, mainly just because I was curious about this myself and uh, how much of a difference there really was. And as you can see in the previous uh, client there's little hitches and stutters as we're getting into different sections of the map. You see the little void up there and then it will hitch right here, load the next part and continue. Well, the NXT client is way ahead. I didn't really time them to be a race, but it's interesting nonetheless to try to look at it in, in that way. And the water is way more beautiful and detailed than the NXT. But even with all of this extra added detail, uh, ambient occlusion, uh, actual MSAA instead of uh, some sort of a post-process anti-aliasing, the fact that they moved away from, uh, I believe they moved away from Java to C++ uh, just really shows how just crappy uh, memory and disk I.O. management and, and a lot of other things are using uh, the, the old Java-based uh, game engine. Uh, the game's playable. It's perfect over there. I, I, I really wonder how many people with a really crappy computer or just a, a laptop, whatever, you know, with integrated graphics, it's nine years old, who play this, who think that I'm not going to get NXT because it's going to slow down everything. Well, look at this side by side. I know I have a really kick-ass system, but 
go to NXT, wait at the loading screen, wait for it to load in, wait for everything to pre-cache. Just sit there, you know, at the lobby. Don't even log in. It's loading things in the background. Don't worry. And wait for it. And by the end of the day when it's done, if your computer is that slow, you'll thank me because barring a couple, you know, bugs that they have to work out that I've read about, I haven't experienced them. You're going to have a way smoother experience, especially if you add a little bit more RAM to your system. Get off of four gigs, go up. I haven't seen it go near that, but it could only help. And so far, I give the NXT client 11 out of 10. The game, though, I'm still feeling in it out, you know? Uh, uh, just play it every night just to relax before I go to bed. Cut some wood, whatever. Do a couple quests. I'm still just a, a free member. But I hope this quick look at the game uh, has enlightened somebody out there. I will see you guys later.